double up three or four times i ain't telling no lies i just run it up on, everybody welcome to sneaker fox sneaker watch and today is throwback thursday so i got a very 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 dope and special review for y'all so without any further ado we got sneaker fox sneaker watch let's take a look at this throwback thursday sneaker this is the converse breaking barriers NBA Hardwood Classic Collaboration, installment number two uh, last week. Or if you look at my previous video, you'll see the other sneaker. Uh, this actually came in a pack of three. So we already looked at the other sneaker for the New York Knicks colorway. Uh, this is the Boston Celtics Chuck 70 High. Let's give you guys a 360 look at the sneakers. I know y'all like y'all 360 look. And then we'll look at the sneaker in more details. So here's your 360 look. Do -do 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 and some of my subscribers said they like to get the top view. Here is the top view of the sneaker. And if you're not familiar with Converse, if you're interested in these, one, you can get in contact with me and I can help you secure a pair of these sneakers. But keep in mind that you do have to get either half or a full size below your regular size because these do run pretty big this is my favorite colorway out of the pack this green color and then satin um if you look at my other previous video everything's pretty much the same except for the colorway and the details of the sneaker and who this particular sneaker celebrates but let's go into that first so this sneaker actually celebrates chuck cooper he was the first African-American to be drafted in the NBA in the 1950s. And he was drafted by, if you see this colorway, you should already know. Yep, the Boston Celtics in 1950. They had the draft in April. He was the first African-American. He was selected number 13 in the draft. He went on to play for the Boston Celtics for four years. And this is a celebration of Chuck Cooper. So what we have here on the sneaker is a nice satin material. This is the best material that I have seen for a Converse Chuck Taylor. And this is all satin. And the satin, and then even the tongue is satin as well. Uh, the satin material, uh, this sneaker was inspired by that material because that is the material that uh, the players back in the 50 uh, season actually played with. Their jerseys were made out of this similar material. This colorway, of course, is inspired by the Boston Celtics. This nice Irish green colorway sneaker. And let's go ahead and look at more details. You have your green upper here. And then you have your yellow stitching, your white stitching, then your green stitching. Then you get to the midsole. Midsole is off-white. And you have your Hardwood Classics um, branding right here on the midsole. And this is actually all off-white. You have your toe box right here this is that nice rubber toe box and for some reason it just seems like a better material than the typical regular one i could be wrong but that's what it seems like anyway um this is all off white this whole midsole uh laces are also off white as well you have your converse badge right here and then you have the two air holes here for your breathability for the sneaker and Another thing that they did, just like on the other, on the, all the sneakers in this pack, this is the first time that a, an actual person's name besides Chuck Taylor is on the license plate. And as you see, you see Chuck Cooper on that license plate. Yep, yep, Chuck. Let's go close. There you go. Let me hit that so we can get that zoom out of there. It's a little bit of a glare, but hopefully you can see that Chuck Cooper is on there. Now let's get into some details of the sneaker. Um, all Converse have the name tag here. And as you see here, it has Chuck Cooper. And it also has uh, number 11 and Boston Celtics. So it has that in there. And I took these out so y'all could see. Uh, here's the insole. It says Hardwood Classic on the insole on this particular side, on the right side. On the left side, it says 
Converse breaking down barriers, which is what these players did as the first African Americans to enter the league in the 50s. So, shouts out to Converse for putting together a sneaker honoring these great, amazing African American athletes. And so, let's look some more details into the sneaker. The inside of this sneaker is this color the Boston Celtics color. It's all green yellow and white and it's got a nice dope design inside the sneaker i think that's pretty dope uh that design inside of the sneaker so that's the right foot let's go ahead and take a look at the left foot and it's the same thing inside so this is a little bit different from the other sneaker that i showed jar uh where it had a big cat his name actually um, on the tongue. This one doesn't have anything on the tongue, but what they did different that the other sneaker didn't have is this design pattern on the inside of the sneaker uh, that the other ones didn't have. And let's go ahead and there you go is the tag that came with the sneaker. Let's go ahead and read what it says here. Breaking down the barriers, Chuck Cooper, celebrate the first three iconic african-american nba players to smash the 1950 color barrier with converses breaking down the barriers collection chosen by the boston celtics in 1950 at the age of 24 chuck cooper was the first african-american player to ever be drafted into the nba the six foot five forward went on to play for boston for four years before moving to the milwaukee hawks so that is the history of these particular sneakers. Got your same typical rubber outsole. Just let me know what y'all think about this particular colorway. Uh, like I said, this is my favorite one from the collection. And this is your Converse breaking down the barriers. I will be taking some pictures so you can actually go to my Instagram at Sneakers in the Fox and check out some pictures that I'm going to do with these bad boys on. And then also you can see the OG Sneakers in the Fox t-shirt with the green sneakers. This is the very first t-shirt that I ever released. Did that to match up with these sneakers. And shouts out to my people here, King Pop based here out of Atlanta. Definitely appreciate everybody for checking out the video. Make sure you like, subscribe. Uh, hit me up on Instagram at sneakers in the fox. Leave me a comment. Make sure you subscribe because whenever I drop a new video, you will be the first one that will be alerted that this is Sneaker Fox Sneaker Watch video. This has been Throwback Thursday. I hope y'all really like this sneaker and really appreciate it and appreciate the story behind these sneakers. And y'all stay tuned for the on feet. And I'll see y'all soon. I'm out. Double up, three or four times, I ain't telling no lies, I just run it up.